So the first feature in the platform product stream that I want to talk about today is multi-select option sets. This is something that has been requested for a very long time, and we're really excited to see it uh, released uh, in, in version 40. This is uh, supported in uh, aggregate data entry at the moment. Uh, it will be expanded into the other, other parts of the platform in the future. Um, but to start off, we have implemented a, an option set type of text with multiple values. So this allows you to uh, specify that the, the user should be able to select multiple values within this uh, option set when they're entering data in the aggregate data entry application. Um, this is a very big, exciting feature. Um, we're hoping to see it also come to tracker and analytics in the near future. Uh, you can already do some things with analytics, but we'll be expanding on that in the future as well. So look for more. And I think this is going to be uh, the, the groundwork work for uh, some really useful uh, uh, user interfaces and data flows for form design for tracker in particular for being able to select uh, from a, a group of, of options which in the past has been a bit a bit cumbersome to do with the built-in functionality of EHS2. So look for that coming to tracker and analytics in the future uh, and we're excited to see it in uh, analytics or sorry uh, aggregate data entry today. Uh, so this is what it looks like in the new data entry app, um, which is uh, was released in version 39. Um, you can see here that there is an option set with red, blue, and green as the three options that are available, and you can select multiple of them. So it's a quite intuitive interface. You can select and deselect very easily the options. You can clear the entire selection, um, and you can select uh, several several of these options um, based on what's what's available. So this is quite useful in a lot of um, public health settings, um, and we think uh, it's useful in, in in aggregate, but also particularly in tracker as we get to expanding into that in the in the future. 